Hello everybody, welcome back today. Today is number three. Number three. We can see all these options for number three. This is how number three looks. Please remember to subscribe to our channel. We really need your help. Let's start. Number three. We have a cupcake here with three yellow balls. Let's count them. One two, three. We have another one here with purple balls. One, two, three. And then we have another one with turquoise balls. One, two and three. It's great to get your child to start counting them in to their cupcakes. And then they've got a number three here. We have a number three here. And if we place this number three on top, get your child to feel around with their finger all around here and count the balls. One, two, three. This is number three. And this is how we write number three. You can start getting them to understand that three can be written, it can be in number form, and it can be counted into three. Here we have again the five frame with three dots. So a child should understand there's a five frame and three dots represents number three. We can also do this in a ten frame, just like this. Again, we'll see the rest are all empty and we have three dots here. One, two, three. We have three dots here, which is one, two, and three. Again, we have our number blocks, which is represented in this way. It's a three on top. And then we have, again, number three here. And this is our number block. And then we have our number block in cube form here with our smiley red face and ha get them to take this away and attach them all on and count back the three cubes. We have three bananas here and we can take out bananas and ha let them count the bananas. This can allow them to count their fruits back to them and then they can identify three fruits. Here we have three blobs. Get your child to count these back. One, two, three. Three blobs. And then we have num three dots on a card here. One, two, three. This is great for children with visual impairment because they can then feel these dots as well. We have our three numicon and three is identified in this form. One, two, three. This is very important, Numicons. A child needs to be able to identify these when they go to school. I'm going to let that go. on my phone. It's not. But you end up with the bigger. Yeah. Great 